Let's get right into it. Are you building something that will live on the internet like a website or web app? Learn JavaScript. The JS community is massive, there are plenty of jobs, and the language itself is very versatile. And 2019 is a great year to be a web developer because there are so many more possibilities now with progressive web apps. Are you building an iOS app? Learn Swift. Are you building an Android app? Learn Kotlin. Nothing beats the platforms themselves if you want to build a world-class native app. And on average, native mobile developers make more than web developers. But what if you want to build both an iOS and an Android app? In that case, you should check out Dart and Flutter. But I totally get it if you don't want to learn Dart, so in that case, just learn JavaScript. And in doing so, you will have magically learned most of what you need to know for Dart anyway. Are you building a server-side application and need it to be really fast? Learn Go or Rust. Both languages are growing and going to be extremely important in the future. And Rust especially so because it can compile to WebAssembly, which will be a huge part of the web going forward. Are you building a game for mobile or desktop? Learn C Sharp along with the Unity framework. Or learn C++ to work with the Godot or Unreal frameworks. Do you want to work with data or machine learning algorithms? Learn Python. It's also an extremely versatile language and a more marketable skill than other data analysis languages like R or Julia. And if you just want a general purpose language that's fun and easy to learn, check out Ruby. Ruby was my first love and I really miss its elegant and almost magical syntax. At the end of the day, learning something is always better than nothing, and learning has basically become my full-time job. So subscribe to the channel if you want to learn more with me. Thanks for watching, and I will talk to you soon.